Recently resurfacing quantum ideas suggest death may not be the final ending. Some physicists claim our perception shapes reality more than matter does. When an observer watches the universe, reality shifts, flickers, and rearranges. This principle whispers something unsettling about life itself. What if death is only a boundary our minds create for comfort? What if the end we fear is only a doorway we shaped? Biocentrism takes this further, placing consciousness at the universe's center. It argues that time flows because our minds need order to survive. If time is a construct, then endings become illusions we cling to. I want you to imagine this carefully. A world where life doesn't end. It changes, folds, and continues elsewhere. Few know this until now. But here's the twist that researchers still debate. Quantum theory allows all possible outcomes to coexist. Every choice, every breath spins into new branches we never see. If that's true, then death in one branch might not be death in another. You continue quietly, seamlessly, unaware of the shift. Some call this the many worlds echo of immortality. Others say it's proof that consciousness isn't trapped to one timeline. And there's something else. When particles are observed, they behave differently, almost intelligently. They wait for us, then decide what they should become. If matter responds to observation, what does that say about consciousness? What does it say about the line we call death? Here's your poll. Do you think consciousness survives beyond physical death? Or is it all a beautiful illusion shaped by quantum rules? Because this question carries a final mystery. If the universe depends on us to exist, then what happens when we close our eyes for the last time? Few know this until now. What's your take?